continue where we left off. So last time we had some, let's see, some weird ideas around, around focus. So what we want to do today, I think, is see if we can fix the focus. So over here, I'm on tab three. And if I go back, I focus the first tab and not the tab I'm currently on. So we want to do a bit of focus control, I think. So one of the things I think we want to do is on the on the tab bar as I want to be able to say tab the current tab item instead of just the first one so I think that was up so I think I put it to do on it. So let's search for to do. There we go. So okay, interesting. So the current tab or the current is actually the one that I select when I do the focus. So this is on the use effect if a current tab changes. So this is no, this is on tab item. Do change the query. Tab item, tab panel, tab panels, tab bar. Okay, so here, here we go. Okay, so this current children. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to have the current index here. So I want to say const current tab equals use current tab. I'm going to say not the first one, but the current tab. So if I go and I say <coughs> Okay, so current tab children current tab so I want to see what the current tab or the hmm ah do you know what it is I have to use because what happens is that this focus and essentially gets cached and with this use effect um, the current time never gets updated, so it always stays at what was there. So, what we're actually going to do is we're going to go we use a callback, I think, and then say current tab. I can take this out. Hopefully this will work. Okay, so let's see. Okay, that seems to be working. Um, Okay, so there's one or two aria things that I think we haven't actually implemented. One of them is that on focus, 
we should always um, open up the tab. So that's going to be on tab item. So I don't want to spend too much time in, on the tab controls. Some other stuff that I think we need to do as well. Um, so this is not on click anymore. This is on focus. So. make it a bit bigger so let's see so when we focus it we jump from one to another the left we go current tab current tab it's on focus now that we actually do the sort of Okay, that looks cool. I focus, we do the select tab on keyboard. Okay, so let's see if you do change the query, that looks for the element on oh, reference. Oh, the thing. Okay, cool. So what's some, some of the other stuff we have to do? So. I want to do now is change this into a motion component. So what we're going to do is that on focus capture I think comes from React. on wall focus that I'm looking for. So wall focus that I'm looking for is border top right bottom left. Up on left to make this a VG border point index. Okay, I want to drop that. The reason why we're doing that is this so on all focus motion Focus outline man, hover. <coughs> Let's do scale. OK, 
kind of get the idea is that what we want to try and do is make the is animate the tabs mm. we can do is because it looks weird. So I was of a border, so there's no point in doing the border. Drop the board transparent part of here. Which means we can pretty much take out all of this. So we make this red again. Okay, nothing. Okay. So yeah, what we tried to do is get this thing to animate from. Let's to animate the colors. So let's do. Let's see if we do something like. Okay, this is starting to look interesting. Let's see. And then my Okay, let's see, background color, border color. So let's do it the way that they're doing it. Come on, 150. Which is all. So let's see, what's the 120, 150. Wrong element, background color. that note. 
So yeah, we're kind of going up to to green now, which isn't exactly what we wanted. Well, three sixty then. Okay, so it's not exactly our color, but it's getting there. So what did we manage to do now? So we were able to fix up some of the tabbing. I'm gonna make it clear which tab we're on. So one of the things I actually wanna do is make that a border too. Or maybe not. Maybe it's just that this color that I've got is a bit too subtle. Go down. Okay, looks like it needs to be quite in the middle. It's the problem at the moment. It seems a bit, yeah, the styling seems a bit muted compared to the rest of the to the rest of the component. Okay, okay, I'm just going to leave it like this for now. Um, yeah, I'm not the greatest designer. Plus, it's probably easier to see how this thing should look in, in the context of... In context, I, I is surrounded by other components. It's got some actual content in the, in the tab panels, that sort of thing. Um, so I'm not going to fuss about the styling. Um, but yeah, so tab left, right. There's some other stuff we can do, like I said, with Aria, is that at the moment we don't have things for for like vertical penetrators panels, which I think is part of the Aria thing. There's some other keyboard shortcuts that we can link that we're not doing. But for now, I think this is pretty cool. So we can left, right, tab back. We've got some frame of motion for styling the transitions and the uh, on the tab and all stuff or the tab items for the for the bottom water and with that i'll leave you guys bye bye